Why Him stars James Franco and Brian Cranston about a girl who's dating a guy. James Franco. We all know how James Franco is. So imagine James Franco in real life and put him in a movie like this. It's James Franco. She brings her family to meet James Franco for the holidays and right off the bat, he is not what they expected. He has a potty mouth, he is rude, he is crude, and he just says whatever is on his mind. He's kind of those people who are like, no, you just, you really got to get to know him. You, you know, he's, he's said a few bad things in the past, but you know, get to know him. He's a great guy. Trust me, he's a, he's a good guy. And he is a really good guy. He has a pure heart. He's trustworthy. He's honest. And that's what I really liked about Why Him is that he was a character that we've seen before. James Franco has played this character many times. He just says whatever is on his mind. He has no filter and he tries so hard to impress this family and it's really endearing. It's very sweet. He builds bowling alleys for them. He brings in all these kinds of food and he gets tattoos and all these other things. And it's honestly so sweet because this guy is trying so hard to impress his girlfriend because he wants to marry her and he's just trying to impress the family but he's coming off on a wrong way of sorts um, but he really doesn't know how to impress the people and express himself and so when he is trying to impress the family and win them over it is very sweet I think James Franco is like the perfect person to play this kind of character I could literally see no one else playing this kind of character that's so crude and you know disgusting but so sweet at the same time. Since he was so sweet to the rest of the family members like the mom and the younger brother they were you know kind of standoffish at first and very stern about it and really didn't know how to handle him but once they got to know him their characters uh, kind of opened up more and were more energetic. They were very stiff in the beginning and then once they got to know James Franco they opened up more and that was more exciting because they were interacting with James Franco more and you know everybody was just kind of having a fun time. Then there's Brian Cranston who was stern throughout and that's a very needed guy in this movie. It's a very needed characteristic for this movie so he was stern but Brian Cranston did a great job in his role and there were like complete opposites and you know Brian Cranston did not want James Franco marrying his daughter so he had to get to know him very well but he did not want to. The movie is very predictable. You can tell where this movie is going. You know how it's going to end. You know how these characters are going to feel about each other at the end and that's okay for me because I really enjoyed the character that James Franco played and how he was playing along with the other characters in the movie. Um, this movie is not gut busting funny. I'm not over my seat just like milk spilling out of my nose. Why do I have milk in the theater? I don't know why. But the movie is not like super hilarious. There is a lot of chuckles throughout. Let me stress that enough. There is a lot of chuckles throughout. I'm like, <laughs> that was pretty funny. Move on to the next scene. <laughs> that was pretty funny. So there's a lot of that. I laughed a lot in this movie, but nothing were like, oh my god. What did I just see? That was so funny, my god. And like clapping my hands and stopping my feet like everybody does in the movie theater. There was a lot of people who did that. I'm like, what is wrong with you? You control yourself, you animal. But overall, I thought this movie was funny. It was enjoyable. I liked the characters. I liked how they were playing along with each other and how James Franco's character opened them up a lot more in the movie. And overall, it was a film that I was glad I got to see. So I'm going to go ahead and give Why Him a B+. It's a film I would buy on Black Friday if it was like six bucks and just watch it here and there. It's not the best film ever, but it's its intentions are pure and I really like how James Franco played his character that you like, you could not date anybody. I don't want you to date my daughter, but once I get to know you, maybe. And then you get to know him and he's like, oh, you're actually a really nice guy. Who would have thought? So are you guys excited to see Why Him, which is released on December 23rd, or have you guys already seen it? What did you think about it? This is Just Watch Movies. At any point, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel here on YouTube. You can also find my Facebook page, my Twitter page, my Instagram page. Connect with me on social media. This is Just Watch Movies, and you stay classy, YouTube.